Hello, AI enthusiasts. Welcome back to the AI Foundation Learning, and today we're diving deep into a fundamental concept that empowers AI systems to process data efficiently, chunking, and specifically different types of chunking. Welcome to AI Foundation Learning. So what exactly is chunking? In the realm of AI and data processing, chunking is the technique of breaking down large pieces of data into smaller, manageable units called chunks. This is crucial for processing efficiency, especially when dealing with massive data sets. Think of it like dividing a big puzzle into smaller sections to solve it more easily. Chunking allows AI models to handle data more effectively, improving performance in tasks like natural language processing, machine learning, and data retrieval. Why is chunking important? Now let's explore the various types of chunking methods used in AI systems. Each has its unique approach and application. Here's the different types of chunking based on the method applied to chunk or divide the data. They are semantic, fixed length, overlapping, sliding window, hierarchical, sentence-based, dynamic, paragraph-based, token-based, and contextual chunking. 1. Semantic chunking. This method divides text based on meaning and context, ensuring each chunk is a coherent unit and meaningful divisions. For instance, in a news article, semantic chunking would split the text by different news topics covered. 2. Fixed length chunking. Here, data is divided into chunks of a specified size like every 500 words. Example, breaking down large texts. Imagine you have an ebook that's 100,000 words long. Processing it all at once can be overwhelming for an AI model with a limited context window. By dividing it into chunks of 1,000 words each, you create 100 manageable pieces that the model can process individually. In essence, fixed length chunking is perfect for applications where uniformity is key and context is less critical. 3. Overlapping chunking. Chunks overlap to preserve context across them. This ensures important information isn't lost at the boundaries. Example, chunk one contains sentences one to five, chunk two contains sentences four to eight. Four, sliding window chunking. Similar to overlapping, this method moves a window across the data to create chunks, providing a continuous flow of information. Example, analyzing time series data where each chunk represents a time frame. Enjoying the insights so far? Make sure to hit that subscribe button and join our community at AI Foundation Learning for more exciting AI content. 5. Hierarchical Chunking This method breaks data into chunks at multiple levels, like chapters into sections and sections into paragraphs. For example, organizing a textbook into parts, chapters, and headings. 6. Sentence-Based Chunking Data is chunked at sentence boundaries, ensuring each chunk is a complete thought. For example, splitting a paragraph into individual sentences for analysis. 7. Dynamic chunking. Chunks are created based on specific criteria or triggers within the data, making them adaptive. For example, chunking logs when a specific event occurs. 8. Paragraph-based chunking. Paragraph-based chunking involves splitting data at paragraph breaks, which is particularly useful when paragraphs represent distinct ideas. For instance, this method is great for processing essays where each paragraph covers a unique topic. 9. Token-based chunking. Token-based chunking divides data based on tokens such as words or characters. This method is often used in language processing. A common example is breaking down code into tokens for compilers. 10. Contextual chunking. Contextual chunking creates chunks based on the surrounding context, ensuring both relevance and coherence. This approach is particularly useful in dialogue systems, where chunking user inputs must consider previous interactions. Applications of chunking in AI. Chunking is crucial in LLMs and RAG. It is vital in various AI applications like text summarization, language translation, and information retrieval. It enhances efficiency and accuracy. 
Understanding these chunking methods empowers us to optimize AI systems for better performance. Whether you're processing text, code, or data streams, selecting the right chunking strategy is key. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and share it with your fellow AI enthusiasts. Don't forget to subscribe to the AI Foundation Learning Channel for more insightful content. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.